In patients with early Alzheimer's disease, clinical trials of monoclonal antibody treatments developed to target different amyloid beta species have had mixed results. Gantanerumab is a fully human anti-amyloid beta IgG1 monoclonal antibody with high affinity for aggregated amyloid beta, which may aid in its ability to alter amyloid beta levels and reduce cognitive decline. In two phase three multicenter randomized double-blind placebo-controlled trials, a total of 1,959 patients, 50 to 90 years of age, who had mild cognitive impairment or mild dementia due to Alzheimer's disease, and amyloid plaques on neuroimaging or CSF evaluation, received gantanerumab or placebo injections. The primary outcome, the change in the clinical dementia rating scale sum of boxes score from baseline to week 116, showed similar cognitive decline between the gatinerumab and placebo groups in the pooled results from the two clinical trials. Mortality and serious adverse event rates were similar between the two groups. However, more amyloid-related imaging abnormalities with edema were found in the gatinerumab group than the placebo group. There were similar findings with amyloid-related imaging abnormalities with microhemorrhages. There were also more injection site reactions with gantanerumab. The authors conclude that in patients with symptomatic early Alzheimer's disease, the monoclonal antibody gantanerumab did not slow cognitive decline more than placebo during a 116-week trial period. Full trial results are available at nejm.org.